What's up guys, Drew Peacock here, bringing you Ricer Cars on Craigslist. Today we got the Honda Special, that means Hondas only, exclusively Hondas. This is gonna be top rice, high roller Hondas, okay? Honda Civics, Honda Accords, I don't know what other types of Hondas I have in there, but there's a lot of Hondas, it's all Hondas. So just, if you get upset by Honda hate, you're gonna hate this video, and I apologize in advance. But anyway guys, I wanna share a quick little video idea for you guys. What would you guys say if I said that you guys can send me clips of your cars doing certain things, depending on what week it is. Send me clips of your cars doing these things to a Gmail, and then I make a video on that. So like, let's say this week, for instance, I had you guys send your cars doing burnouts, or some cool shit like that, like burnout type clips, to drewpeacock.clips at gmail.com what would you guys say about that would that be something you guys are interested in if so go ahead send me some burnout clips we'll just try just simple burnout clips this week i feel like you know that's something that everyone kind of has send me some burnout clips at drewpeacock.clips at gmail.com and then we can go from there and also put the subject as burnout and then um, i'll know that it's for this video so drewpeacock.clips at gmail.com send your burnout clips and i'll be making a video on that we'll see if you, how you guys like this idea also give me ideas on what else you guys can send um i want to kind of make it more clip oriented so pictures that's more for rice or nice clips maybe for drewpeacock.clips at gmail.com so anyway guys let's dive right into this video with this 1996 honda civic or trade forty five hundred dollars valencia Okay, this was the only image that he had of the front, and you can see, obviously, underglow, right off the bat, underglow. Black bumper, we got a big old black spitter with some support rods right there. We have aftermarket wheels, white body, aftermarket grille, tinted headlights. Uh, if we go to the rear, we see, obviously, the tow hook. You need the tow hook for the Honda Civic. It's a track demon, man. All day slaying tracks, okay, so you got to get out of the ditch every once in a while, maybe help your opponents out. You got to have the double wing, so you got one wing right here, you got the roof little spoiler right there. You got to have the double the downforce, of course. I mean, if you're on the track all the time, that's kind of what you need. We do have a little sticker mess all over it, so we got sticker mess on the rear window. We do have the weather guards. You need weather guards. Weather guards add down first. Weather guards add down force, they add 15 horsepower and 15 styling points, so that's just a need right there. Going to the interior, you would think it's a sleeper car. I mean, look at that thing. That thing is bone stock. Obviously, this guy put all his money into the engine. He said, screw the interior. Recaro seats, I don't need that. I need a baby seat. That's what I need. Going into the trunk, I'm assuming this is a trunk. We got some sort of a compressor right here, probably for airlift. I'm assuming. I haven't read the description yet. We also have some subs right here. Another rear shot just showing off those stickers. Honda, of course, on the side. I mean, you might have mistaken it for a Ferrari or some sort. I would have obviously mistaken it for a Ferrari because it looks so close to one. Another side shot, you just see that beautiful underglow. The Honda on the side, the stickers, the wing, the other wing, the tow hook. What can go wrong? You got tire lettering too. I mean, that's just sporty as hell. And then now the interior he shows, boom, just when you thought it was stock, I got a little little trick up my sleeve just to get the ladies impressed, you know, make them take off their panties. So you got the green Lucky Irish underglow right there. That's probably what helps him win all of his races. It's an automatic. So going into the description, he obviously says uh, every little thing that I've pretty much, you know, described right here, but in a much more boring fashion. He's being super humble right here, not saying how, you know, expensive and how fast his car is. So fully stock motor i am i'm i highly doubt that if you got all this on this on this car no way it's stock no way it's fully stock why would you do that buddy i mean no way so anyway if you guys think that this is a nice car you know go ahead hit up this guy uh 4500 bucks for this gorgeous lamborghini uh replica right here go ahead hit him up obviously he's being really humble in the description so he's got a uh, custom paint shaved doors front doors electronically pop and trunk Integra rear disc brakes, nice, okay, he's got disc brakes from an Integra, sound system with outdoor speakers, of course, when you're racing on the track, you need that, two kill switches with Viper alarm, radar detector, of course, he's a fighter jet, no need about that, automatic transmissions, uh, Garmin GPS fully stock motor, again, I think he's lying right there, he's trying to be humble, of course, he's probably got a built motor, twin turbo at least, I would assume so, anyway guys, let's move forward. Honda Civic SI 2009 JDM 7K in Miami. So let's go to this beautiful first photo. And of course, you see those mint green wheels right there. Beautiful wheels. Of course, you need that on your Honda just to stand out. Every other Honda has chrome and maybe black. You need that mint green just to let everyone know that you're a little bit special. He does have yellow fog lights right here. And everyone knows that, you know, that thins out the air in front of you. So while you're racing and stuff like that, the air in front of you is less resistant. It's just, it's a proven fact right there. You can give that a quick Google. We got a toe strap up here. We have this little hood protector right here obviously deflecting all the rocks and shit when he's on a lamborghini's ass on the freeway i mean it's just it's obvious okay uh we have the offset license plate because this guy is race car af 
he does have some defense on this car he's got plus 16 defense of these little spikes on his wheels that's just it, he would have had more if he would have had the full lug set but uh these little uh, air caps are well, they'll do just well on the rear of course every honda comes complimentary with a tow hook everyone knows that straight from the factory you also have the blue tip the blue exhaust tip factory little wing right here nothing too out of the ordinary there the red badge of course it's a type r everyone just don't worry it's a type r guys don't worry just take a seat we do have some vortex generators on the roof which i hope we get a better uh, photo of i don't i don't see them really in any other good photo and eh, they're kind of here but we do have some vortex generators here's a nice you know aerial shot i guess if you wanted to look at your car from the perspective of a giant uh the interior again very clean interior actually can't really complain about this one so this one does look more factory it is a manual transmission that looks like nice interior I actually like the interior on this not being sarcastic i actually do like the interior on the on this generation oh there we go nice nice vortex generators oh and he's got the built sticker okay okay so this guy must have a built motor or something like that and he's got some nice fitment right there and of course the weather guards how did i i almost forgot the weather guards another plus 15 for downforce plus 15 for styling you need weather guards of course every honda needs weather guards so let's see what he's got all right so uh, under the hood it looks like he's got a uh, intake six speed very fast so um yeah very fast built car right there very fast moving forward we got honda civic 2007 now okay we're, we're going back in time a little it was 2009 now it's 2007 7200 dollars right off the bat we gotta start with it we got the black hood black headlights black lip okay this guy's going for the trifecta right here he's got a little grill delete i like that offset license plate of course better aerodynamics honda messed up by mounting it in the center and so he said screw it i'm gonna block the little lower grill better aerodynamics right there weird aftermarket wheels like some crazy low rider shit they're okay and of course there we go again the tow hook you need the tow hook everyone needs a tow hook sticker frenzy on the back window he's got his little instagram right here if you really want to zoom in and follow this guy go ahead he does have of course the double spoiler so he's got the rear roof spoiler he does have the little duck bill spoiler right here this is a lot better than the salad bar hanging off the back or a park bench but um it's still it's still there the gold tow hook this guy has gotten 250 headshots with his tow hook so it's gold and going on to the interior, he's got the footwell lighting. He does have an uh, aftermarket steering wheel. So he has the little dildo shifter. He has the little pink handbrake. I got another sticker bomb just going on in the inside. And when you, if you're a girl and you climb into this car, this guy's picking you up on a date. You just feel so respected. Just suck me and and all these nice stickers over here that you can stare out while this while you're just obviously while your your panties are soaking and stuff like that. And then of course you can lay back, tilt the seat back, and you'll be in a galaxy, baby. You just you just close your eyes and you'll be in heaven. Okay, this Honda Civic, it'll take you out of this world, no doubt about it. So. Engine run perfect, no leaks, bring mechanic of your choice, manual 5-speed plates good until February of 2019, smog check good for 2 years, JNC wheels 004, 205, 40, R17s, K-speed, coilovers, NRG steering wheel with hub and quick release, plus minor custom things. I'm surprised he didn't uh, mention the roof liner. I'm surprised that wasn't mentioned. I'm surprised that he didn't mention the aftermarket shifter or the sticker bomb that's gone off on the exterior. I'm surprised he didn't mention also the tow hook and the duck bill and all that stuff. But anyway, very clean car, obviously. This guy has a lot of speed under the hood. And he's just being, again, a humble person. $7,200 for this mean machine right here. Obviously gets you all the street cred you can ever want. Next up, we got a 2001 Honda Civic LX four-door sedan. Drew Peacock, that shit looks stock. That shit looks mean stock. Yeah, well, the front's a little bit deceiving. All the aftermarket shit on the front must have just flew off when this guy was running around the track because you go to the rear, and of course, the complimentary tow hook from Honda. Every Honda I see nowadays has a tow hook. I mean, I, I get it. They're track demons and stuff like that. You know, they, they say that the, the 03 Honda Civic can beat a Dodge Demon in the quarter mile stock. I, I didn't I didn't know that. But yeah, that's what every Honda Civic owner says. So uh, we got the little Vortex generators. He's missing one because of his high speed. The owner, uh, I actually contacted this guy and he said that uh, he was cornering so hard that it flew off. So, I mean, I'll, I'll take his word from that. It does look like a speed demon right here. He's got the tow hook, the far can this car is a little bit more of a sleeper obviously he didn't want to you know stand out like the other ones so the interior stock automatic of course there's probably a manual conversion under there you know you could probably just throw that around like a manual it just looks like an automatic uh he's got some really clean gauges right there 
and uh, again some really nice aftermarket wheels he also does have this little weird quick disconnect on the bumper but it's not hooked up so i don't know why he did that he has this nice little pinstripe going down the side and uh overall just a really clean subtle car you know honestly if you did just take off everything that this guy put on it would just be a stock car just uh just gonna say that really quick i know this car isn't super riced out but it, it did have the little tow hook the shitty vortex generators and the fart can and of course probably the automatic to manual transmission conversion i wouldn't doubt that that's a, a manual right there just you know hiding in plain sight also 306,000 miles holy shit decent interior overall great car ac works and blows cold air runs great works great nice this is an old one wow that's not bad for no 3,500 bucks gets you 300,000 miles. Next up, we got the angry 2003 Honda Civic EX 03, $5,500. Right off the bat, he's got some nice wheels and some nice tire lettering right here. Of course, what what does it say? It looks like it says Maximum GT or something like that. I don't know what, what that's for. I don't know if that's the type of tire he has. He does have the visors, of course. He traded in his tow hook for, for weather guards. He traded that in. What a nice guy right there. Gave someone some... Oh! No, he's got the toe strap. He went for the weight reduction option. He got the toe strap instead of the toe hook. He has some tinted tail lights. Obviously, he never slows down, so he doesn't need them. He just took them out. He has the red badge. Everyone needs a red badge. He has the little, uh, he has the sunroof popped open for downforce right there. Extra downforce, of course. And he's got some angry headlights. So when he's on your tail, chasing you hot around the ring, you know, to get out of his way. Because this guy ain't stopping for shit. He has some yellow fog lights. You guys already know what yellow fog lights are for. I don't need to repeat that. That'd be a waste of time. Red badge up front, of course. Interior red badge, just so you can see it and feel, you know, nice and sporty. He, it is a manual transmission, actually, so that, that's a big plus of it. I actually can't complain about the interior too much. The interior looks fine. Uh, under the hood, he shows what he's packing under here. He's got a nice cold air intake, which is, uh, you know, placed, you know, generously right next to the motor. So that's really nice. He does have the red painted brake calipers. So obviously extra braking power right there. The rear, he does have some nice aftermarket taillights. I do like those. Those look nice to me. He has this nice little running light going around, you know, covered up by the angry eyebrows, I guess, on his headlights. It's an angry car, okay? This guy, uh, he's sad when he loses. He's angry. He's tired of being the, the runt of the pack. You know, all, all day while his friends are driving, you know, nice cars and he's driving this, he's, he's, he's a little upset. So he's got to make it a little bit angry. So again, I'm kind of just, you know, finding the little uh, cheap cars to throw in this. This little uh, little cheap little budget ricer right here. But uh, nevertheless, still a little bit rice. Last up, I was really scraping the bottom of the bucket for this one. We have a crazy good deal. 96 Honda Civic Custom for a thousand bucks. I mean, with a title like that, how can you complain? From the first picture, you can obviously see the nice 24 karat gold wheels, of course. Stanced by Exhibit himself. He also has the angry headlights, of course, just to let everyone know he's a little bit more fierce. He has the high performance grill delete to let maximum airflow go into there. Uh, the Camaro ZL1 copies that from the Honda Civic. Look that up, it's a proven fact right there. Under the hood, he's got this big old aftermarket intake, obviously, you know, cold air right next to the engine, of course, just perfectly placed he does have a black and orange engine so tony the tiger himself uh customized and built this motor so let's get a little signature from him that's how you can tell tony the tiger did it he doesn't have the visors and he doesn't have a tow hook so this guy this guy's going for the super weight reduction he doesn't have the visors nor the tow hook he just has the gold wheels and the aftermarket intake awesome deal 96 honda civic body straight custom rims rims with brand new tires bbk headers and an aam air intake Fresh Acura GSR Trans with a fresh D16Y8 motor. Must see, trying to trade, let me know what you have. So he's not trying to sell, he's trying to trade, I guess. Um, so let him know, you know, if you want to get rid of your STI, this guy obviously, it's a great deal. Get rid of your STI, get rid of your Mustang, get rid of your Integra, get rid of your actual new Type R. And then just hit up this guy, it's obviously a great deal. He's got some BBK headers, so he's, uh, he's willing to trade for something anyway guys that's gonna wrap up this episode of ricer cars on craigslist the honda special if you guys like this little honda special thing and you want me to do other cars drop a comment and let me know what cars you want me to do if you guys aren't a part of the peacock flock go ahead hit subscribe and click on those notification bells so you can flock to the videos and be a genuine peacock flock member stickers are on the way i mentioned this last video so just keep your eyes out for that and also don't forget to submit your clips to drewpeacock.clips at gmail.com hashtag burnout let me know uh Send me your burnout clips and uh, also drop comments on what other clips you think you should send. Until next video, peace.